Oh, it's hazy. Yay. Right. I didn't do any videos yesterday, but I got some, I got made ahead. So I did. Let's see. So I made this was it last night. Yes. Last night. Last night. <laughs> made that last night. And um, I showed my daughter today. I said, well, daughters. I said, oh, what, what, what do you think I should make? And she said, mom, I love the star, but you should make a butterfly. So guess what I'm going to do? Right, so that's torn paper. And I did that in one sort of, then I did a star bit. Well, I did one for the star behind it because I thought that was quite small. So what we're going to do today is a butterfly and I'm going to show you how to do it. And I'm not going to do it in one because I don't know if we'd be able to do it in one because it would be wonky unless you folded the paper in half. I suppose you could do that actually. Ah, well done. <laughs> Well done, my my mind. I have now discovered how we can make the butterfly. Right, I'm just going to grab some more papers. I've just printed out a load of vellum, but I don't think it's going to work as well. I don't think that's a, uh, let's have a look on the light paper. Hmm, I don't know. I printed that on the same, same as that, but I don't know. I think I'm going to use this one. Same as Lou used before. Okay, so which way round are we? Yeah, I did this by accident, actually. I was trying to print that. And I'd left the clear sheet of acetate on the... Um, I put, even put the word there, acetate, when I was writing. <laughs> Can you see that? <laughs> so what I'm going to do is... I'm not going to fold it in half. Because if I fold it in half, I'll fold it in half there. Hold on, how big do we want it? So I'm measuring on the page how big I want the butterfly. So I want it quite big. I'm going to do the butterfly first. Then I'm going to spray. Spray. Wow. So what I'm doing is tearing. Tearing. So it's like an arty journaly bit in your in your, your junk journal. So you can always do this. You can always put an arty journaly bit, can't we? Right, I'm going to make it into a... Oh, we've got a pointy bit there. Um... I'm not sure where to make two lots of wings than a body. I think that'd be quite a good idea because that would be easy all round. Let's see how that's gone. I bet it's gone terribly. Oh, that's not too bad, is it? Oh, that's about the right size. Can you see that? Yes. Let's put it in the middle. Right, so that's about the right size. So now we've got to sort of make a, another bit. Uh, mm. So how are we going to do that? I'm going to be tearing. So we've got a... I don't know why I'm doing it like this. I'm not sure if this is logical. But I've started a bit lower there. Let's see if it's logical. Oh, will we have to turn it upside down? You know what I'm like with logic. <laughs> Who, me? Logic? I haven't got any. Okay, so let's have a look at that. Now that is how it turned out. Hmm, that looks the same, doesn't it? if we can so what i've done is torn it in half and now la 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 there you go <laughs> so it's worth it isn't it so i'm going to move those down and hmm i don't know where to put some something on top let's get another bit i'm going to make something slightly smaller um i'm going to try and do the similar thing it doesn't matter if it isn't because it's like a an experiment at the moment because I've never done this before. Never, 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 never I've done this before. Da -da. Right, so if this uh, works, we can tear it like that and put them there, can't we? And we can do the same thing for the other one. So I'm going to go down again like I did before and come round. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I'm just tearing and just arrange it as you like on the on the butterfly, on the flutterby, as it used to be called. I don't know if you knew that, but what, originally butterflies were called flutterbys. So I don't know why they became butterflies. I think that looks a bit. I think it needs to be a bit thinner there. But it's got to be. I have a bit, even if it's going to be torn. So we're going to put that to the leg. That's yours. Well done. There we go. There's a very posh voice, that is. Ha, ha, ha. Right. 
so there we go so what we can do and if you want to do um <laughs> i was gonna say antenna if you want to do antennae um i don't know let's shall we see if we can find a different color for the look oh, different colors on each side huh but never mind eh right uh, well, where have my papers let's have a look i don't know what they've got in there i don't know why i've gone posh but i have gone to posh right so usually i go the other way around i go well actually how can you say the other way around that's horrible <laughs> i usually go unposh all right and my daughters was here this morning uh, all here today and we was talking about that actually I'm not sure if that would look right um we was talking about uh posh voices my youngest daughter she speaks with a quite a nice um sort of voice we've all said that and my i'm trying to do ahead now and my middle daughter said that she spoke really common that's the one who copies me <laughs> not copies me that's the one who's always messing about like me with a voice so we're going to try and make a we can always lengthen if it's too short we can always shorten it if it's too long because if you look at butterflies they've got like a little they've got a head a body then they've got a long bit there so let's have a go at doing that it might be too long <laughs> and um oops. I don't know if that's going to be right or we'd need a darker colour. Hmm. So they're sort of like that. And they've got a little, sometimes they've got a little thing at the end. But anyway, I suppose we could stick the um, bits on there first. And I mustn't forget to spray the page because I'm going to spray the page. So we've got a background and then I'm going to draw in the antennae right a bit that so that would make quite a cute look i was trying to pull it apart then that is not a part so i'm going to now glue each piece on each um level now where's more my glue i've got different glues oh there's a um, oh i'm not sure how much we've got left of that well we've got plenty i think that felt quite light so I'm going to put that about there, say. We could have an experiment to see how it's going. I think that would definitely go more like there. I'm going to try and do the other one similar. So you shove that on there like that. Shove it. <laughs> yeah, shove it down. <laughs> yeah, you can put it how you like, how you think looks nice. Or you can just shove it down and hope for the best. But <laughs> I think that's probably, it was sometimes work very well. Now, this is just basically torn paper. So, as I said, fold it in half, which I hadn't even thought of that <laughs> until I actually started this video. So, it's amazing how things come to you. Um, on the hoof. <laughs> is it on the hoof? Is that the word? But anyway, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Right. Here we are. So, about that. That's the fine for the uh, bottom two wings. Now we've got this one and we've got, oops, we've got a little buddy attached. We're not touching you yet, dear. Right, so we're leaving that there a minute and then we're going to have a look at this. We could even swap them over. Let's see if we can swap them over so that the red's on the opposite side to what it is on the bottom. Um, would that go? Have I, well, have they taught me there about that? Yes, I think so. We could put it, no, let's have it a bit, tiny bit closer about there. So I'm going to put some glue, some glue, some glue, some glue on there. Oh, I've got some Mod Podge, but I don't think I'm, I don't think, oh, I was going to use the Mod Podge, yes, wasn't I? But uh, where have I put my brushes? That's the trouble, you see. I, those brushes I've got, those makeup brushes I've, I've been using, they um, don't um, stick. You know what I mean? They don't go hard like normal brushes, but they do go missing. <laughs> that's the trouble <laughs> right so we're going to put these quite low down there i think it might be best to perhaps glue them i don't know where to glue them on the back oh let's have a look i know this is on paper and it's gluey but let's have a look 
so I'm going to put that there and that there just to make them stay right, and that's um oh come on <laughs> I have to put them up there let's put try and put them there I don't know if I've got any washi tape I have got loads of washi tape all over actually I've got a massive bag here let's put something on let's use a bit no that's a pretty one <laughs> Let's use something I've had years. One of those. Right, so let's put a little bit on that. This is only temp, sort of like a a thing. I don't think you'd be able to, hopefully you won't be able to see it through the other side, but we can just check that that looks okay. And the wings seem to join together there. Is that going to be viable for this design? And let's unglue it from there. Right, um, no, that doesn't look right, does it? I think it needs to be they need to be up a bit more. I do think they need to join actually. So we'll have to undo this. Oops. We'll undo 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 that. And we'll undo this. Right, I've mentioned my grandson earlier because we were talking about my um oh dear, I've got to be the other way around, haven't it? I meant we was talking about when I did the Jaws theme and my grandson did the Emmerdale soap theme instead of the Jaws theme once and we don't know where it is or which video it's on because <laughs> I'm going to show my daughter and she's going to show him but I can't remember we can't remember which one it's on no that's not going to be right is it that's going to be terrible terrible so it's going to be a completely disaster all right um, I'm going to try and move them around even more because we're going to so is it good no we need to put that under there don't we like that otherwise that's going to be on top we need to put the wings otherwise it looks it would look fit funny and it will probably wouldn't be able to fly poor thing so i'm going to try and put it like that more let's glue it glue it stick it there so i think we're in that's more like it isn't it yeah Oh, you know what I could have done? Ink it up. Ink it up. What am I like? I could have inked it up. So, um, that would have given it more definition. So, we're going to make a little triangle there in the middle. So that would be even, wouldn't it? Right. So, you probably make a better job than me. <laughs> love to see them if you do. Well, you know, I'd lo absolutely love to see them. I mean, that's... Uh, I don't think mine's going to be brilliant, but it's going to look fairly not pretty, isn't it? Now, that doesn't look straight. You don't have to get them straight. I'm sure all butterflies aren't even, but let's try and get that a bit more. I'm looking at the whether that side looks the same as that side and that side looks the same as that side. Anyway, that will do, won't it? Uh, yes, I was going to ink up. Well, that's not the ink uppers. Where are the ink uppers? The ink all over there. Ink wrappers. Let's get some ink wrappers. Let's get some pretty ink wrappers. We have to do it because it's all flimsy. <laughs> right. Uh, oh, come on, come on. Shall we try and get you flimsy, flimsy butterfly? Let's, let's ink up the. Um, that's far as cross we need. We need, I tell you what we need, but walnut stain because it's brown. We need some nice brown. And I've got that the right round. I've got an extra bit there. That could be a leg, but we're not having a leg. Sorry. Sorry, butterfly, but you're going to be flying. You're going to have your legs tucked in where we can't see them. So we'll just move that leg. Yeah, I think that's... Um, uh, hopefully the right size if not we'll have to do another one <laughs> right and it's there we go so i'm just showing you all how this works because i and you always have to have the body on that side i don't know why <laughs> really it should be underneath <laughs> but let's have a look see what it looks like underneath no no you see that doesn't it doesn't compute does it that does not compute or does it I don't know. Perhaps we should have it that way. We should actually have it that way, shouldn't we? Because it should be underneath, actually, like that. So what I'm going to do is put a bit of glue, bit of glue, on the bit we didn't see, 
which was probably all these but okay and I'm nearly gluing it to there I don't want to glue it there yet because I'm going to put some even though I've got colour on it, it doesn't matter we're going to glue it look I'm doing it all on the page instead of on the page on the so the butterfly's got a little head and it's got a little tail and it's got a little paley tail there so that's the way to do it that's the way to do it and we could ink that up a bit more we could put a bit of colour on the page see if we can get that a bit darker I'm getting a bit of colour on there it doesn't matter because I'm going to spray it right so we've done it like that so we've got a little head that's a little bird of fly we're going to move him out of the way it's a him even though it's it could be anything right Right, so yes, I was trying to find the video of my good of me pretending, me pretending to um, have a laugh with my grandson. I don't know where which one it is. So we all want to know where it is. Now I'm going to put a brown. I'm going to put dull colours on there because, right. So I've got their tea dye, and I think I've got. I should have a a um, antique linen, which is the one that's running out. But let's do it. Let's go. For Right, I'm going to put in this corner now. Um, if you didn't want to make your Friday mess, I need something to. Oh, yeah, hee haw. Here's some, uh, I'm like a donkey then. <laughs> he -haw. I mean, he -haw. right? So let's put this, um, on there and on here. Let's put some on there, and on there. right? And on here and on here I sort of like spray around a bit that's all I do don't have any water I haven't had any water don't usually add any water probably because um but you can if you like mop the bits up that's um I mean you can spray water but that paper's uh well it's under GSM I think that one was it I don't know if it's not it's 80 <laughs> right uh so we can put that on there like that we could have journaling spots here and here or we can do other things right we could put little bits there if we want instead we've got lines there for journaling spots all i've put on that page is a napkin <laughs> so and my stars there look my star my star yeah right so that sort of matches that anyway let's glue it down or him down we're going to call it an it we'll call it a him a him right i'll sing that and i'll think of hymns when you sing <laughs> right um right, should we glue that bit onto the bit better and we're going to come around and we're going to whoa, what do we get we're getting stuck again lot i'm because i'm gluing on the page look just can we just move over there a minute while we glue this on the page i've got cereal things no cereal packets when you get those um uh, you know those in a in a cereal packets they're brilliant for gluing on and pushing in between things i've got loads of them but they're not down here they're all upstairs when my son's using the computer today but next week he should finish his dissertation and send it in it's funny because he says that <laughs> he's the only one out of seven to send his dissertation for review to the tutor that's quite funny so she's going to get loads this weekend uh he's very very meticulous and very he plans things how can you how can i have a son like that a son that actually plans <laughs> i'm sure they all do let's get rid of this little bit of paper I do hope you like me a bit of lay, but it does make a pretty uh, impression in the journal. It's like an arty thing as well, in a way, isn't it? You've got pretty, um, you can use 12 by 12 papers, all sorts, but that's just paper. I, I think it's, I put, what I did was put paint, you know, um, that, um, oh, I can't, the, the powdery stuff, you put powdery stuff and you just sprinkle it on and that's a, um, scan of that and i've got oh there's an extra bit i've got more no nope, that's not extra right so uh that's what i did for that so that's quite good and this as well this is what i did was it this i was using 
what was that I was using yeah so a bit there there's some I'm using a crackle I think it's Tom Tim Holtz crackle um stencil as well Poor, I don't know how I used it, it as ages ago did it but anyway we're going to do now is if I can find my son's pen no it's not there so I'll have to use a different colour where's the black now I've got a biro let's have a look see if that works it does so in that we're going to do some little so it's got to have those hasn't it you can't have a butterfly without those there. so there we go we can have i don't know if it's got those at the bottom <laughs> but i'll draw them anyway where are we there we are. draw those little things <laughs> i don't know if it's got those or not and i don't know whether to give it a bit of a color in because it needs to be a bit darker doesn't really matter it's cross hatch and there we go right then so that is a beautiful but i'm going to just finish the page off perhaps by using the, the door bar 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 so let's um the blending tool the blending tool <laughs> that's what they're called on if you go on amazon they're called the blending tools all right so don't know if it says it on it. No, it doesn't. And um, there we go. Right, so I'm going to just do that around the edges, which does finish off the page. I'm not sure whether to put any bits on, like any other butterflies. This is the um, this is the big butterfly on the page. I've got all the butterflies, but I don't know. I think they ought to be torn out if I did. So what I'm going to do is, I'm um, not sure whether to do something on there as well, because it doesn't look finished, does it? Unless you put lines on it. Look, I've got my rulers down here. I'm sure they're all upstairs. Um, mm, so, 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 let's try lines. Let's have journaling lines so we can do a bit of journaling. Because you've got this is art journal. <laughs> oh, we've got to do. Oh, we've got to. Because um, I think it's nice to have a bit of a mix. You don't have to stick to one thing just because you do it one thing. They're in very pale, light, pale, um, faint lines. They're not really pale, are they? For black. Right. So let's see what that looks like. So let's go one more. And so there you go, a few journey lines you can write about right around the butterfly. So when I come to a bit of butterfly, I'm going to avoid doing a line on the butterfly. So there's a bit there, the bit there, the bit there, and the bit there, and that little wing is higher, but hey. And so you know, like it, it looks nice when somebody's written around the object. I think that's really pretty doesn't matter if your writing's like because this is like um this is like scribbly writing i've done that scribbly writing it's like faux almost like faux writing i've done there and we're going to move this up a bit because i'm used usually missing off the bottom so we're going to move it up so we can start let's start there i mean you don't have to write up there but um so all I'm using is a piece of um, card and it's not even straight which makes it more attractive doesn't it when you it's like a you know it's like a thing a homemade look which it is which is what that is anyway so the whole page I think that really makes that page and it doesn't really matter if it hasn't got any extra bits on it so when you come to writing you'll have sort of like you'll have any way you can write any way you can put any things in i mean you try and avoid writing on there but it, it looks nice when somebody's done that i mean i've, I've, I've put writing there as well <laughs> so encourage or to write i could put a little um word at the top perhaps 
So I'll write a little word at the top. Let's have a think. What can we put? Uh, let's put the word journal. So we're going to put the word journal. There we go. Journal! In no dating. <laughs> That's in my sort of courier type writing. So I think that looks quite nice, doesn't it? Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe and char. Um, and make lovely videos. <laughs> and uh, all of them. And have a look, see if you can find any more of my silliness. Um, I do tend to mess about a lot with words. I'm sorry about that. I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. Sorry, but not sorry. Okay, hope you've enjoyed it anyway. Thank you. Bye.